and welcome to Let Them Play Games. Uh, today I am not with Aaron. Um, today oh, I'm we? with. Amateur yeah, SFX. And. X Bubble Monkey X. I.E. Something Woody Entertainment minus Hayabusa. Uh, and, and affiliates. And affiliates. Um, <laughs> uh, we're playing Monster Prom, and I'm the only one in this room that's never played this game. It's true. We You're played in for it. Such yeah. a good time. We I... played it on Friday, our last Something Woody stream. So you can check that out on Something Woody Gaming if you want to see like me and Izzy reacting. You say to last kinda... last Friday? Yes, it was last Friday. <laughs> that's gonna date. I know it is. Well, I apologize. <laughs> Welcome to not streaming. It is on fucking Something Woody Gaming, so you can go check that out for like me, Izzy, and especially Max first reactions. But today it's Logan's first so when, reaction. When you guys played all these graphics were probably like keyboards and stuff yeah this didn't come up at all oh. right? i think it i think it only comes up if you have a controller plugged in maybe in what the future on like it? another session we'll all mm -hmm. like aim to get three controllers so that we can all like do our own thing but we'll have to it's, do one um I like it's turn based so yeah. i doubt it would really make much no difference. it just means less shuffling around less like do that and then yeah. inherent arguing in the system yeah, yeah. that's fair it's yeah. not a huge deal. Ah, spooky Ooh. high school, the sweetest years of our lives. Ah. So we're, um, I have the voices and stuff on, by the way. Oh That's yeah, fine. they're barely there. It's mostly just like <clears throat> reaction noises, okay. they're like hit hit and stuff like that. Yeah. So uh, yeah, explain the general premise of this game, both again for me and for people that are watching. You go to high school and you want to date one of the six hot ass monsters. So you want to woo them and get them to go to prom with you, and or have sex with you, and or both. Yeah, yeah. All right. So wait, is this you? Yeah, I'm gonna be her. <gasps> I want to be Flamey Girl. <laughs> That's too bad. Fuck you. Oh, you're calling me Firebird. <laughs> All caps, Firebird. All caps, Firebird, misspelled. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> oh, oh my the, god. The E is silent. Oh my god. Are you a she or a he? Or are they? I'm a she. Perfect. Who's player two? Me or is he? Uh, you decide. Uh, fucking, uh, I don't know. You. Me? Yeah, why Sweet. not? Sweet, I'm gonna take that adorable. You liked it too much. Girl. Is he a player two? Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> I will be. Um, I'll be yellow. All right, this spooky dude here. We yeah. we're still not sure what he is. What would you like your name to be? I think he's be? either a slime or some sort of shadow. Yeah. What would you like your name to be? Um, let's see. Last time I did Izzy. Mm -hmm. Um, and his def like default name is Oz. So like, fucking. I mean, you could say like what you are, but we don't know what he is. We don't know if he's a slime or a shadow. Slime we can make shadow uh, boy. We can make Chase very happy and call him the Sizzler. <gasps> call him the Sizzler. Oh. All caps. No, no. <laughs> Lowercase. Where appropriate. <laughs> 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 no, no, this isn't okay. I hate this. Where's the space? Uh, Is there? I don't think you're allowed to have spaces in your name. It'll just be one big name. Oh, really? Fuck. You yeah, you can't. Uh, That's fucking hilarious. What if you want to like, put in like their full name or something? No, nah, ridiculous. Oh. Tig. Your oh. name is just Tuh? Oh, no, oops. You went I, back I fucked it up. I, I was, I'm figuring out the controls. Uh, you're terrible at this. Shut up. <laughs> All right. Uh, there you go. Just spell the correct way. Never! Never! Do this for me. No! <laughs> <laughs> I hate this already. Just like in real life, Izzy hates his real name. <laughs> to Sizzy. To Sizzy. Oh, I love it! <laughs> oh, just make it Sizzler. No, to Sizzy! Sizzy! Are you a he, are you a she, or are you a they? It's a he. It's a he. <laughs> Solid. All right. You... All right. I want to be the, the Frankenstein girl. Was that a Eagle Raptor? As that guy? Yeah. I don't know. To I know me, he's in this. It, he's, uh, he's a wolf boy. Yeah, yeah Eagle Raptor Scott the wolf guy. Yeah, uh, I don't so... know if he's also Oz, but yeah. Um, yeah, I want to be the, the zombie girl. Yeah. I but always she's, think it she's, sounds like Seth Green. She's a Frankenstein's monster, not a zombie. Clearly. That's true. She has the neck bolts. I'm sorry. That's what I meant. <laughs> Jeez. Jeez. Uh, what do you want to be? What will we call her? What do you want to be that I will misspell? <laughs> <gasps> Let's call her Zombu. That... Call her Burbo. Burbo? <laughs> Why? <laughs> all right, I have an idea. I, I, I've listened to all of your ideas. Okay. And I've decided that... Zerbo? <laughs> Is that where you're going? Do, 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 do. Zombobo. Zambubo. Zambubo. 
I'm Zabula. fine with that. <laughs> Exotic. <laughs> But you're clearly she, a, you're clearly a Frankenstein. Why she, is your name Zombubo? Yes, it's a she. Okay. <laughs> Man, when you're really breaking Yay. down to zombies and Frankenstein's really all <laughs> that different. They're not that different. And we had yet to experience its ultimate challenge. The monster prom. Da, da, da. I remember it clearly. Three weeks were left. And as do we actually get like three weeks to Yes. Okay. And as we fantasized about our dream prom dates, we were all scrambling to catch the attention of one of our six most charismatic classmates, says I, doing a character voice for someone one that none of us picked. This is the narrator, dude. Question. This is where you will pick who your most appealing <gasps> person is. Do you yes, think we should think. do what we did um, uh, on our stream where, like, since there are the three girls, three guys, we each just voice a guy and a girl, a so it's fair? So it's, like, evenly split sure. among the voices? Cool. I called dibs on Polly. I mean, I feel like I should get dibs because I haven't seen the game before. That's that is true. Fair. You okay, get first well, choice. Okay. Miranda Vanderbilt, 19, a sweet mermaid <laughs> princess who was as cute as she was genocidal. Anime McAnger. <laughs> Damien Valet, 21, a fearless demon with a taste for destruction and a love of fire, and I'm already about him. I love him. Everyone He's my loves Damien. Favorite boy. God Howell, 21, a werewolf athlete who compensated for his rather small brain with a stupidly huge heart. Jesus. Mm. Liam DeLioncourt, somewhere in the range of 400 years. A hipster vampire whose standoffish demeanor hid that he was truly a lovable dork. Yay! Polly... <laughs> trying to figure out who the voices are. Oh. Polly Geist. Is that just 220 who knows? Oh, no, I think it's just 20, like 22? 22 maybe? Yeah. Like she probably died when she was 22. Uh, what was that? Yeah. A party ghost with an insatiable hunger for human blood. <laughs> Which won't come into play because no humans are here. Mm -hmm. She's a vampire ghost, you see. And, a vampire ghost, And Vera ghost, you see. Oberlin, 23, a mean, self-made Gorgon with a merciless sense of business. A Gorgon, not a Gorgon. Gorgon. <laughs> okay. It's a Gorgon. It's a, it's a fucking, it was clear. It had to be one of them. But who? But who? We had only three weeks to choose our prom date, and even more daunting, we only had three weeks to woo them and conquer their heart. Mm -hmm. But as I already said, we were young and unafraid, and we were ready to start. Yeah, boy. Cue the Kesha music. Ooh. Ooh. Welcome to Monster Prom's stupidest pop quiz ever. Ah. All minds are rotten, but they're rotten in so many different ways. Worry no more. We're now using our PhD in bullshit to diagnose which kind of deviant sicko you are. Do we each take a quiz? Yes. Yep. Monster we each the same question. Ah, okay. Yeah. Monster Prom stupidest pop quiz ever, trademark. We'll throw a <laughs> bunch of absurd questions at you and turn your answers into your character stats. This way each of you will start by having stats that better reflect your true selves. Let's start. Let's start! Which god do you pray to each night before sleeping? Oh, gosh. This is you. This is Firebird yeah. first. Yeah. So, praying is for fools. I took compromising pics of a god molesting a tree, and now I blackmail him for whatever I want. A lot more effective. Pray for all kinds of gods. I have this business where people pay me to deliver their prayers every night. I've even started... Okay. Praying is kind of lame. I have a group text set up with some deities. <laughs> all right. Nice. Um, oh, my God. Coolest cats in town. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and do the blackmailing a god. How about you, to Sizzy? Uh let's go with uh that one. I I have a I have this business where people pay me to deliver their prayers every night. This and worked what? out perfectly, because I want the bottom one. Excellent! <laughs> Yay! So smart, so wealthy, so, so charming. charming. Democracy's just broken. What would be the best way of choosing the leaders of modern society? Whoever can play the most heartwarming violin solo wins. You put all the candidates in an empty room with a wild grizzly bear. Whoever kills the bear should that one. <laughs> Remember to vote! <laughs> like, you haven't even read the last one. I don't care. That one sounds like the way to go. If everyone dies, it's obvious the bear should be the president. <laughs> <laughs> Create a reality show called America's Next Top President where the candidates can be in all kinds of physical and mental challenges. Voters ter Voter turnout would increase and we would turn a profit on it. My God. Hmm... Eh, I'll go with the, the last one. You would turn a profit on it. Bear. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Presidential bear. <laughs> yeah, you, you read this option. one, Izzy. Yes. What criteria would you use to name your children? Eh. Oh, God. A lot more answers. Oh, I know the one. 
I haven't even read all of them. I've seen my ahead, answer. Izzy. No, it's yours. No, but like read them. Oh, okay. oh, I will research for a name that is uh, pun proof and joke proof. No one will pick on them. Oh my god. Good Something luck. simple and friendly, like Bobby or Mary. Ugh. Just a swear word. A non-heteronormative name to give them freedom to define themselves on their own terms. <sighs> my name plus two, the second. Oh. <laughs> Meh, no name. Just too much work. Oh. <laughs> I'm, I'm between these two. Just a swear word. Because I want to be a bad girl. <laughs> but I also really like the idea of Firebird the second. <laughs> Fear... A fire Firebeard the second. Firebeard. 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 Uh, uh, I like that one. Nice. To Sizzy. I would say... Say just a swear word. Why not? Just a swear word. Curse. All right. Do you have it in your head who you're going for yet, Izzy? Because we already know them. Logan's Prime. I feel like maybe trying to go for Vera just because none of us have tried it all yet. It's true. Okay. I Mostly because she seems kind of caustic, but maybe there will be some fun dialogue. So I think I want to shoot for Polly. From what you've seen, do you know who you'd want to shoot for? Um, either the the tiefling-looking motherfucker or... It's Vera, right? Oh, yeah. no. Wait, Damien? Damien, Damien yeah. or um, the the Gorgon. Oh. Yeah. We're going to have a fight over Vera? <gasps> Are we? Uh, yeah, uh, I mean, I don't want to fight anybody. <laughs> Not this I mean, that's anyway. how the game is played. I'm, I, am, I am Firebird, though. Love is a battle. I am going to, I fucking spec myself to be cunning and destructive. Should we? Which worked out, by the way. Yeah, you, you have nine <laughs> smarts to yeah, start man. with. Um, should we tell them about the rooms and stuff? Uh, is, is it just kind of as random where they are? No. Um, uh, each room uh, gives, gives you, you a different skill. stat bonuses. Oh, okay, yeah, I, I so could probably what interpret was it? which the, ones they are. The uh, bathrooms were boldness. The The tree was fun. fun. The yeah. gym was charm. The classroom was smarts. The observatory was money. And the auditorium was creativity. Or the Looking. library is uh, money. Yeah, sorry. Yeah. I'm, I think I need more boldness. So really, yeah, I need maximum boldness. Is nine maximum? No, no, it, goes uh, way it keeps going up, 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 up. Mm, boldness. Ooh, look at how sexy you are, that girl. That day you just skip class and just hang out in the bathrooms because you you don't respect no authority. Damn right. I guess some people just want to watch the world burn. I mean, you're a fire I mean, burn. Yes. Yeah. I, <laughs> I skip in class and hanging out in the bathrooms. Take that, society. You give plus zero shits, but you gain plus two boldness. Hell yeah. That's fucking right. <gasps> Is he doing? <gasps> ah. Oh, uh, my God. What oh do no. you do? It's the boy you might like. Ah. Uh, uh, who's going to be the, these two? Uh, you had first pick on uh, who you wanted to voice, right? You did. One boy, one girl. Well, I'm, I want to hit on him, so I would think that I shouldn't be him, but at the same time, I have no idea who we're, I'm going to end up bumping into a lot, so... I was him last time. I was him and Polly. Mm. Fuck it, I'll be him. <gasps> Yay! I, I, I don't know about girls. Someone else be her. <gasps> Fucking... Can Izzy please <sighs> be her? You know what voice I want you to do. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, we're boned. <laughs> I do not know what this bold bound means. <laughs> bold, <laughs> but I'm not optimistic about our chances on the upcoming exam. It's not fair. I shouldn't have to fail the test just because I spent all week in a really brutal mo mash, mosh, mosh pit. pit, mosh a mash, mash, mash pit. pit. Mosh all, all these goddamn potatoes. All smash. these potatoes. <laughs> Be a just great way I, to mash them potatoes. Just because I spent the week bathing in potatoes instead of going to class. And I did study. I had my servants read the entire textbook twice. What a prissy bitch. Uh. <laughs> but for some reason, my servants aren't allowed to take the test for me. Well, there's only one thing left to do. Chop up the teacher and melt his body in acid. No. There's got to be another way. Doesn't that? <laughs> <gasps> what will you do? Oh, no. Oh, no. Also, I can't remember. Did Aaron say that Miranda was his favorite girl or Polly was his favorite girl? I know that he loves Miranda. He's, yeah. But I can't remember who he said was his favorite. I'm, I'm made of fire, so I have to go with the option that includes fire. <laughs> you don't? Okay. 
Oh, shit, yeah! Shit. Finally, a good excuse to do what I was probably gonna eventually do anyways. <laughs> I'm not sure it's exact. It's actually a good excuse. <laughs> but it's too late. I'm, I'm Damien I'm and I'm here. <laughs> Damien is already running through the halls with two <laughs> gallons of gasoline, soaking everything. That's a new narrative. Later, as Damien is le let out of school in handcuffs for the third time this week, he gives you a smile and a wink. Ooh. Ha! Suckers. They can't make me take the test if I'm in jail. I win again. <laughs> Jesus, Ooh, you Damien. got so much Damien, Damien love, Damien's my happy boy. and only a small portion of the school burned down. Looks like everybody wins, <laughs> except for anyone in that small portion of the school. You gain plus two fun and plus one boldness. Oh my god. They will be missed. god. Alright, where will you go? Easy, uh, where will you go? Let's go to the library. <gasps> You gonna make that cash money? What a money? studious boy. Gotta get that cash, cash money. Go, go ahead and read the narration stuff for your own character. Okay. Yeah. That day you spent some time on the library's PCs, playing some good old online poker. Gambling seems like a stupid and dangerous decision. But who cares? The time is this time paid off, so fuck it. <laughs> you gain plus two money. You did it. So much money. Huzzah, I have nine of the money. I'll do, like, actual narrator. Later, you come across Damien and Vera. Is it Vera <gasps> or Vera? I think Vera. I think Vera, it's Vera. In the hallway, like the like the burger place, nonchalantly holding a locker shut with all their strength. The locker has a sign on it that says, Nothing to see here! And is screaming also. Shut the hell up, you! I want to hit on her, so I don't want to be her. Oh, uh, okay. You want me to be her? Sure. Well, oh, but then I couldn't be Polly. Because if we're doing one girl, one guy each. And you've already been a girl. Okay. Mm -hmm. Adorable, fluffy go. little... <laughs> fluffy! You see, we're spending quality time with our new pet. Isn't that right, Damien? From somewhere within the locker, you hear my parents will pay anything before Damien kicks the door. Yeah, that's right. I'm supposed to be in jail. Adorable, <laughs> quiet, fluffy. Who's gonna stay quiet if he knows what's good for him? Do you know I don't really have a great track record with pets? I had some mice for half a day, but my hair ate all of them. It sure would be a shame if I had to voice every character for the next five minutes. <laughs> if our new pet died before we receive the true joy of pet ownership. Yes, exactly. The sweet, sweet <laughs> bank account filling, filthy rich making joy of pet ownership. Surely you have lots of knowledge about pet care. Why not share some of it? <gasps> what will Lizzie do? Okay. Let's find out next time on Let Them Play Games. You know what pets love? 